so let's talk about how you built it and then we'll get to the liquidation. This should be a good story. So you have this first building, eight units, you find a nonprofit that rents the whole thing. You have equity, you use that equity to buy the next thing. Um, That's kind of where we're at in the story. Yes, that's where we are. And then I just renovated that one a little bit and I rented it. That one wasn't that old, but because I had the like the, the money from the first one, I could secure the second one. I didn't have to go for absolutely dingy building. Yeah. Right. Because sense. the first one was really dingy, but then at that point you have some something in your hands. And that way you can keep growing. All right. So yeah. what where do you get kind of so at this point you're holding everything? Like you're buy you're buy and hold at this point? Yeah, I bought hold. And then, I, as I said, I was focusing more on the renovations and creating right. cash flow. But mm-hmm. then, you know, it was just awful. The tax was like 50% on oh, this. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay. So I just was really annoyed because I worked really hard and I couldn't manage to make more than 60000 a year. Wow. Yeah. And plus my passive income. But still, you know, like... That's after three and a half years of this work, I Mm -hmm. just left to the US. All right. So you're 25. Yeah, 24, 25. Yeah, that's when I went. Yeah. And you come to the US. So did you sell everything right then? No, no, I I hold it. It It's my passive income every month. Cushion. It's called cushion. Yeah, Yeah, right. (laughs) Cushion. Yeah, exactly. All right. So uh, you had what, 14 units, I guess? at 14 units and a garage. Yeah. And yeah. the garage. Okay, great. So, all right. So you come to the United States. Uh, wait, so what happens to the properties? Like where does you just buy? You're just holding, you're collecting rent, cushion. Just holding, collecting rent. And what I did with the money, most of the money I had from the rent actually went to half of the money. I think something like that I had is structured went to an investment account. Okay. On an auto pay and the other, other part I was living on. Um, I wasn't living on because in the U.S. everything is really expensive. In Europe, yeah. I could have lived on, but it was nice to get every month two thousand dollars. Yeah, you know, it's not much, but like it pays your food and and a lot of yeah. stuff. So that was kind of in a crisis in two thousand. I came to the U.S. winter seven. I mean, okay. yeah. yeah, and I came here. I was here just for a vacation, and I moved here full time in two thousand eight. Okay, all right. I really like that idea that you've set up the auto pay. Yeah. Like quote, quote unquote, pay yourself first, right? Take fifty yeah. percent, put it here, and then the yeah. other fifty percent, you ball out, do whatever you want with yeah, it. Uh, it's you your fun to. money. Yeah. yeah I, I like so, that. and I have to say, as I said, like I came here first seven, and I went back to Germany, and did some more work. I came back two thousand eight. It took me a while to to full time move here, but but honestly, two thousand eight nine to have this two thousand dollars a month as a cushion was really really helpful. Meaningful, yeah. Yeah, it was meaningful. Very, very cool. It was good. Yeah, you could. In the worst case, you could literally live on that money. In the yeah, US you could. As you well. could make it happen. And I, for fact, did because at some point when I applied for my green card, it took like nine months to get the paperwork done, mm-hmm. and um, I had to. I couldn't work, so I, I would just rent a room. I was mm-hmm. very frugal my whole life. I didn't care. I rent a room for six hundred dollars a month in New York City, and I would just cook and eat, mm-hmm. take the subway and you could mm-hmm. totally survive on 2000 a month. It wasn't a luxurious life, but no, but you could survive. You know, yeah. You can without yeah. being broke. Yeah. On the street. That's, yeah. That's, that's, yeah, yeah that, that's, that's pretty amazing. 